Hello everyone. Well, three things to say today. Uh, firstly, uh, our appeal for the Hope Charity uh, is still open, which uh, obviously we uh, communicated last Sunday and interviewed Naomi McBain about her amazing work with um, families in need, vulnerable families. Uh, Hope are doing wonderful things locally here in Mid-Sussex. Uh, so please, please do give generously uh, and all the details are, you know, it's the, it's the general giving to the point church account but if you could put the reference hope then we'll know to get that money to Naomi uh, she really needs our support at this time so please do give generously um, second thing uh, after the government's advice yesterday now people living on their own can hook up and form a bubble with a family uh, or another another person so uh, we really want to obviously encourage that. We know that some people have been uh, very isolated over the last few weeks. And I'm sure that uh, many of you are, are forming those bubbles uh, with your family uh, and friends. But if you need any help at all, or if you, you'd like um, to hook up with a church family, then you know we'd love to facilitate that. So please do let us know. And, um, and finally, this whole issue of racism and justice uh, which has been in the news so much recently. Um, we're going to tackle it on Sunday. We're going to look at it. Uh, there's it's such a big issue. Not thinking for a second that one Sunday will cover it, but we are going to look at it this Sunday. Michael Holt, our youth pastor, is going to be preaching on this issue. He, he had a session with the youth last week, and he's going to share some biblical insight with us. And we're also going to have a, an interview with Dave and Sarah Emmanuel, uh, to get their perspective and we're going to be praying please i'm sure we all are but please do continue to pray for justice and for peace okay god bless you see you on sunday